Jumping is one of the most essential movements when coding games in Scratch. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the simplest way of coding jumping in Scratch. If you're interested in a more professional jumping, I'm going to leave a link in the description of the video on how to code jumping and gravity in Scratch. Jumping involves two movements, an upward movement and a downward movement. Let's suppose we want our cat to jump when we press spacebar. As I said, we're going to need two movements and we're going to use the glide block. I take it twice for each of the movements. If the first movement is upwards and it ends in this position, we look at the coordinates and we copy. Negative 6, 66. The second movement will finish here. So again, we copy the coordinates. But let's keep one thing in mind. Um, the X represents the horizontal. If we want a vertical movement, these numbers have to coincide. So let's put a negative 6 here as well. And now let's press spacebar and let's see. As you see, this movement is very slow for a jump. So let's reduce the number of seconds that each gliding movement takes. For example, let's put 0 0.3 and let's check. All right, that's way more reasonable. So this is the end of the tutorial, probably the shortest tutorial I've ever made. But this is all about the simplest way to code jumping in Scratch. See you in the next video, guys. Bye bye.